According to a mid-long-term railway network plan released by China in 2016, the country's high-speed railway network will reach 38,000 kilometers by 2025, connecting all provincial capital cities and cities with a population of over 500,000. That will largely improve connectivity between major cities as well as third and fourth-tier cities across China. It is only the third plan on Buli Train Network building, which comes 12 years after the first such plan was released. But it has tremendously changed the concept of regional transportation in the country. The high-speed railway network has largely improved the integration of neighboring cities, especially in the major economic zones such as the Yangtze River Delta and Pearl River Delta. Inner city traveling in these areas has become as easy and convenient as inner city transportation. The network has also helped hasten people-to-people -people communication, as well as industrial structure reform. According to China Railway Corporation, the country's Buli Train network has reached more than 20,000 revenue kilometers, more than 60 percent of that of the whole world. Since 2008, high-speed railway passenger capacity has been growing by an average of 30 percent each year. Every day, there are, on average, 4,000 Buli trains in operation. The network has transported over 6 billion passenger trips up until now. Compared to planes, which suffer from a higher rate of delay in China, Buli trains have won over more and more passengers by their on-time performances. Experts say the new development plan and the speeding up of Buli train services highlight the arrival of a high mobility era. That in turn requires better network management. China's high-speed railway development started up from cooperation with the West. According to the World Bank, China's bullet train system has become the most competitive, characterized by its price and quality advantages. We have formed our own bullet train branding, but we still need to strengthen cooperation with the world's leading high-speed railway companies, especially in the area of network management. China is currently exporting its high-speed railway technology and trains. Buli trains with Chinese standards have successfully entered Russia, Thailand, and Malaysia. It has become another reflection of China, contributing to world openness and connectivity. Tambo, CGTN, Beijing.